Today's a crazy day, and I'm finally getting married. It's finally happening. Ooh. Um, so I'm just going to take you guys to like the venue, um, what kind of food we have possibly. I'll try to show you guys as much as I can without showing too much on my big day. You know what I'm saying? You know, I got to focus on the big day. Got to show y'all a couple slides here. But this is the wedding venue right here. Stop playing with your boy. You know we had to go big or go home on this one. And of course we went with the pink flowers out here. That's her favorite. Hey, and this is the car that I bought for her. So your boy had to really show up and show out with this one. No cap. Mm, look at that. I'm driving a Bentley Bentayga like I don't love my life. Stop playing. Look at the wheels. Hey, and this is my lovely bride right here. Stop playing with the boy. We married to the money. I do. All right, guys. I lied to you guys, by the way. That was completely a joke. Um, I had to do it for the thumbnail. It was a horrible joke, in all honesty. The execution was horrible. Everything about it was horrible. And I think it was so bad that that's what makes it funny, right? That's the type of humor that I'm into, like the ones that are so, so bad that they're actually funny. But anyways, let's get into the real topics here. We're going to be doing our skincare routine, um, doing a couple of other things throughout the day. And I'll try to record as much as I can for you guys um, as we get to this journey of going to 30 million subscribers. Right now we're at 2 million. Thanks so much for subscribing, showing love. As always, like and subscribe. Um, we're trying to be the biggest vlog channel in the world, right? I know not that difficult to be honest we're gonna do it we're gonna if you want to invest invest right now you better invest into this because we're gonna blow up soon and there's just a couple of things that i'm just gonna be doing i like to keep my skincare routine very simple so i'm gonna show you guys exactly what i use and, and how i keep this keep this simple so i first start off with this cleanser turns out they're actually a supporter of zionism so after i'm done running with this i am going to be going to another um, cleaner cleanser i should say i'm going to be going to another cleanser and using that um, instead of this zionist supporting cleanser um, but pretty much i use this and then i use a toner and then i use some vitamin c and some lotion i'll show you guys what i do so pretty much, you gotta wet the face just a little bit. You know? And then you get this. I put just a little bit on there. Um, nothing too crazy to be honest, because I, I don't need that much. But pretty much, I, I just use my hands. Then I just rinse it off with water. You can see that my skin is already like cleared up. So I'm gonna dry this off and then use my toner. So I just dried it off with a towel. I don't know if you guys can see the difference to be honest, but um, it just feels a little bit more different, more clean from last night's skincare routine. Um, in this video, I'm gonna be doing my morning skincare routine and then uh, in the next video, hopefully I get to do my nighttime skincare routine. But anyways, after I'm done using this, your boy goes to this. So all I do with this one is get a nice clean cotton pad, get my toner, and then put some right on. Nothing too crazy to be honest. Sort of like this. I don't know how well you guys can see this, but this is just a itty bitty dirty. And that's how it looks after the toner. After using the toner, this is how my skin looks. Again, I'm not sure how well the camera picks up like the changes, but this, this is the change. All right, now that I've pretty much brushed my teeth um, and got most of the other skincare routine, I'm gonna put on the vitamin C serum and get that taken care of. This is the L'Oreal one. So this is what it's called, just in case you guys can't see. So pretty much all you do with this one is grab a bit of that vitamin C and put like two to three drops on your face and then rub that right in so this one you just kind of like lotion so this is the after of my skin I don't know if you guys can see it very well but this is pretty much pretty much it and now I'm gonna just throw on some moisturizer I also got to put some oil in my hair I'm gonna show you guys which oil I use 
So I got this from Target. It actually smells really, really good compared to the rosemary oil that I was using. Um, I'm not sure if it's like really helpful or not, but it helps my hair be nice and shiny and not so dry. So this, I like this. All I do is literally just drop in a couple drops. That was a lot. But that's pretty much all I do. And then just rub it right in. And this is the final look after the whole skincare routine, getting the hair done. Um, this is what it looks. And then my hair, you can see, nice and curly. Um, and it also looks really nice too, and it feels nice um, with that oil. So I recommend that oil. If you're also wondering about which kind of uh, moisturizer I use, lotion, it's this one. It's, it's nothing special. It's literally just Vaseline cocoa butter. I like this one because it's not so like slimy feeling. Um, and it goes on really nice on the skin. So that's that's why I like it. Um, it's also on the, I forgot what the app was called, but it's this one app that like monitors how much like carcinogens or bad chemicals are in a product. And this one said that there wasn't that many and it was like a 99 or like 90 plus score rating out of 100. So it was a, a good option, alternative. Um, the other one that I used to use was Cetaphil, but turns out they support Zionism. So I switched to the Vaseline. Hopefully it doesn't come out that they support Zionism. And if they do, if you guys could comment um, any alternative brands that work just as well, I'd appreciate that. And I just put on the lotion. And again, I don't know how well the camera picks it up and how like good it looks. And hopefully it looks good, but that's the skincare routine, y'all. And in all honesty, I like to keep my skincare routine. Uh, like I said, it's literally just a cleanser, a toner, um, and vitamin C in the morning. That's pretty much it. It was kind of ridiculous today. It was extremely hot, wet. It wasn't the perfect time, you know, but people were telling me, yo, you gotta cut the grass, you gotta cut the grass. So I, of course, I had to cut the grass, you know what I'm saying? Yo, long story short, man, your boy had to spend, like I said, a few hours of his time getting you know, all the grass mowed and everything. This is how the plants are looking now, midsummer almost. But yeah, had to mow the grass and everything. Mm -mm -mm. A lot of work out here, a lot of work. And this is the garden right here. That's my biggest op. I just had to kick them out right now. But this is how it's looking. Nice, thick, green. You can even see some of the cucumbers. And the onions right here. We cooking it up. There's potatoes right there too. The potatoes. Your boy's getting right, bro. We about to feed a village. That's all, folks. Thanks for watching.